This conference will now be recorded. Hi. Good morning, everyone. Today we are going to discuss about uh, Balsmic. As you know, like uh, Balsmic is a kind of tool which is available on cloud. So which is majorly useful for uh, creating mockups and wireframes and all everything. So as a part of Balsmic, what is that are we going to develop? So whatever the developments are we going to do is what comes under Balsmic. Hi, today we are going to discuss about uh, Balsmic. As you know, Balsmic is a kind of tool which is uh, widely used across industries to create wireframes, mockups, all that. So this Balsmic is a tool which is uh, used especially for the people who are into business analysis because business analyst people major focus is to understand requirements and providing solutions accordingly. In view of it, people has to understand what Balsamic is all about. So why these wireframes and mockups and all everything were important to design diagrams, all that, the kind of uh, visualization of requirements and all everything we have to show with. That's the reason why it is always important for us. There are different different tools are available online. Like we prepare uh, UML diagrams and all using rational rows, Microsoft Visio, all that, as well as flowcharts, everything. The same way, Balsmic is a kind of tool which is available across industries to develop any kind of application. What is that we require, all that stuff. So this is generally a tool which is available on cloud environment. We are, we are in trial version is available with us so that we can use it whenever we are needed. Now here you can see there are different different options. Let me explain you about the options first. Then I'll get into the next one. So in this Balsmic, the very first thing is that if you want to create any kind of project here. So here you have an option called for projects. At the same time, if you want to add any kind of people to the existing ones, wherein if you want to invite your people, for example, when you are working as a business analyst, if you want to invite your people to be a part of this team, Right. So because whatever the wireframes and mockups we have created so far, if people wants to see all these things and all this invite people is something essentially available to them so that we can add as many people as you want. You can send them an invite to them so that whatever the required invitation we have sent. So people will see that. So based upon the invitation, so those people will also be a part of the team so that whatever the work are we going to do, everything will be taken care of by them. That's what generally people work. So irrespective of the kind of project we are developing, adding people and all everything is also something essentially important so that people who are involving in this can see this well in advance. At the same time, if there are any kind of settings to be made in reference to the project itself is concerned, if you want to create any kind of settings in, in reference to that, that settings can be done. But as far as the development, as far as the creating of uh, report, uh, creating of wireframes and mockups, of course, there is no requirement for the settings, which is that we want to see. So that is not something essentially required here. Now, here are the options where it is available here. You can create a first project here. At the same time, after once the, we, have, we have created a project where we have an option where I'm going to show you what are the different, different uh, uh, wireframes and mockups and all everything you can see. For example, if you are creating some alert box on the page, at the same time, or else if you want to create any kind of uh, progress bars, like progress bars or search boxes and all everything, each and every box is available here. Even this is for whatever you can see, here is an Android. Here you have an option called all, right? So if you are clicking in all, so whatever the required uh, options do you require on the specific page and all, everything you can see, right? Either it could be calendar, either it could be callouts, or it could be bar charts or it could be pie charts, right? So whatever the charts do we require, everything can be seen here. So otherwise, if you want to develop an application according to the requirements, what we have, for example, Android is what generally we are working on. So Android is a kind of tool, which is something we are working on here. So we have an option here where we have an option for Android. Android is uh, one thing which is there. So even for example, if you are developing any kind of Android applications or something like, so this option can be seen. At the same time, if you want to create any kind of uh, 
buttons and all everything for example if there is a page you are creating there are some buttons which you have to mention so far right so whatever the buttons you require so those buttons can be prepared at the same time for example if you want to create any kind of containers right so for example either it is for the phone or for the ipad or if you are creating any tab bars and all everything these containers are used for that purpose at the same time if you want to create any kind of forms right so for example especially being a business analyst we may require to create a login page so whenever we want to create a login page there are different different forms which are essentially important to perform with those forms can also be prepared here accordingly at the same time if you want to mention any kind of icons or something like or else if you want to create any kind of layouts in reference to the project itself these layouts can be prepared here apart from that at the same time of course these are all medias and all everything so this is how generally it will be now i am just going to create a project first so whatever the project creations i am doing and all based on that whatever the relevant informations to be prepared and how these relevancies and all everything will be prepared here accordingly this is how generally this balsamic is a tool which is widely used across industries will be used here so creation of project is also essentially required as i mentioned you you have to create a project it depends on the kind of project what is that you are going to do because you may be creating a project for different different wireframes and all that you may be required different different wireframes to be created whatever the wireframes do we have and all everything that we have to create here accordingly so wireframes and mockups and all everything can be created here that's what we need to do so i am just creating my first project here so that right from the first project onwards we will be working here now here your first project this is what i was just creating i'm creating a first project so that you will be understood more right so this is how generally the project is created right now when you want to create whenever we have created a project whenever we are working on it we have to understand what kind of forms to be prepared for example being a business analyst team you want to prepare a form right so for example you want to prepare a form which is something relating to a page where you require some login kind of stuff right so whatever the login related stuff and all everything if you require let's say for example whatever the login page is required whatever the login related information is something essentially needed to understand it all these things can be prepared here accordingly right so whatever the login pages and all everything can be prepared here apart so here there is an option where you can create a group name for this right so here uh, group names can be created so based upon the information what is that we have for example group name called um, i'm just mentioning as banking application okay for example banking application right so banking application is a is a page i have a name i have given for this wherein if you want to extract extend the sizes and all everything these sizes can be extracted like this you always have an option where you can extend the applications here this is how generally these extensions of the applications which can be taken into an account right so this is in banking application where for example if i want to create a circle button right so circle button may be required for any different reasons whatever the reasons it could be maybe for initially to start with right for example start is it start is it what i am going to do start is what i am going to do here so whatever the start button you have and all everything for this banking application this start button was used at the same time if you want to choose any kind of colors whatever the color picker and all everything this color picker you can see here right so whatever the relevant colors and all everything so these colors can be used so as of now as far as the application itself is concerned we don't require any kind of color pickers all that at the same time for example if you want to mention the date right so mentioning of the date for a particular application wherein you want to mention here for example uh, 01 Zero four, zero five, and two thousand ten. Right. So this is what the date I was given. Right. So this is the date I have given. And do remember, this is the date I have given based on month, date, and year. Right. That's how you have to see. Zero one is the first month, date mm dd dd is date. Zero five it is two thousand ten. Right. So this is what generally the date which was created on the banking application. wherein the start button and all everything was given here accordingly at the same time apart from that we need to have an option where we have to understand where if you want to create any kind of uh, uh, 
uh, sliders and all everything. These sliders can also be used here accordingly. Whatever the sliders do we have and all everything. So these sliders can be used here. So whatever the required uh, sliders you want to here, because for example, if there is a page extension we have, right? So the page is so long, right? So depends on the kind of slide ex exceptions. What is that we are going to do? Whatever the slider extensions and all everything is what we want to see. It's what generally the slider applications and all everything is that, right? So this is where generally the sliders and all everything are being used here. Right. So this is where generally the sliders and all everything is being used. So this is how generally the sliders can be means if the project page, whatever the page we have created, for example, if the project was project page was more broad, broader, all that stuff. So these project pages and all everything will be created here accordingly. This is where generally this sliders and all everything are being used so that you can slide it. Right. So slide it according to the adjustments. What is that we require? whatever the sliders and all everything is required. So those sliders can be done here accordingly. Depends on the kind of page. What is that we have created? Because there will be some lot of information which is available sometimes where we have to mention these informations according to the requirement what we have. Now, for example, for this banking application, let's say, for example, if you want to create any kind of icons, right? So for example, any kind of icons in reference to that number or something like those numbers and all everything can be gained here. At the same time, if you want to create any kind of layouts, for example, if there is a taskbar which wants to create or if you want to create any kind of scroll bars, for example, scroll, whatever the bar I have created here, this is for the page extension. But whereas whatever the scroll bars I was mentioning here, these scroll bars and all everything for top to down, top to down. So this is how generally this scroll bar is what we have prepared here where the, here is an extension which can be done right so we can do this extension like this whatever the related extension and the relevant extensions do we have so these extensions can be done here accordingly right so this is how generally this can be used right so this is what it is next at the same time if you want to create any kind of buttons for example for this page you want to write any kind of buttons or something like so here is a button option where we can create this button option here for example uh, button for like so for example home page right so home page we are creating home page is what we are creating here so apart from the home page we are even uh, creating home button is what we are creating after that we are uh, mentioning about a banking application i'm talking about right so home button at the same time options uh, if, if it's a regular application and all everything home button about us services all these will be there but as it's a banking application and all home button will be there at the same time for example the kind of services they were offering whatever the services whatever they are offering and all those services can be mentioned here apart that is one thing can be done at the same time whatever the um, contact details can be mentioned here right so contact of course contact details can be given later later in point of time contact details can be given later services and this kind of uh, apart from the services and all we can provide an option for um, login right so login is what i was mentioning here in here itself so before to the login i'm just giving an option called sign up normally this can be created anywhere here apart right so sign up login contact details right so all these informations can be prepared here accordingly so this is depending on the kind of page what is that we are creating and how is that we have created in what way we have created and whatever the pages do we have all these things is what we have to see here when you are talking about this contact page sign up pages and all that so this is how generally this uh, home pages and all everything are being used for now uh, let me put you this here i'm putting the start button here right so services and all everything these services pages and all everything these pages can be can be created wherein if you want we can uh, give some uh, space in regard to that if space can be given even so a space can be given here whatever the space related and relevant spaces and all everything those spaces can be created 
right so whatever the related space is in the so those spaces can be created and whatever the options do we have in the so those options can be given here apart right so if you want to align something like this you can align home button services sign up button all that so this is how you can see right so this is how you can see it at the same time if you want to create any kind of accordances and all that stuff, right for example if you want to write down the items and all right so whatever the related items and all items can be mentioned here for example uh, for example let's say current services apart from the current services even uh, savings related stuff can be there at the same time if it is something relating to savings and all right so savings option is there at the same time we are even mentioning about uh, in this savings uh, uh, i can create savings account here i am mentioning uh, uh, deposits right so this is what it was giving right so deposits is what i am giving here right so this is how generally the current is what we can create so this is how generally the creation of current pages whatever is something related and relevant uh, is what we have to create right so whatever the uh, creation of the pages and all everything is what we have to do so this is how generally this creation of pages and all everything so we can create whatever the options do we have and how are we doing it in for what way you are doing it so what are the options to be required to make it perform that more better is what we have to see so when we are right so this is where generally this current savings whatever the savings accounts deposits and all everything so these deposits and all everything can be seen here accordingly this is how generally it can be created even it could be in current account you can could be in savings account right so whatever the deposits we have right so savings account deposit savings all these can, all these things can be mentioned here accordingly is what generally we do here at the same time for example if there is any kind of comments to be written and all other thing we can written but as far as this banking application itself is concerned we don't require any kind of uh, um, any kind of uh, these uh, markups and all everything are required so we don't do that at the same time for example if you want to put any kind of image right so let's say for example any image relating to uh, an application called xyz i'm just mentioning it as xyz right so i'm not writing anything here any image to be created so those images and all in reference to the application of uh, the existing one so where these images and all everything can be created here like for example there is an option where if you want to put this image here whatever the related and relevant images and all everything can be copied here now i am just copying some image right so not exactly the same but something something uh, whatever uh, for example this is what the image i want to open right so this image whatever the image and all everything so these images can be copied here accordingly and whatever i'm just uh, this image and all everything relating to this application application image i am talking about right so this application image can be upgraded like this right so these images we can copy and these images we can post here right so this is how generally right for example right so this is an image let's say right so project co company banking related application image and all so these image can be kept here apart right? this is one thing which can be done right so these images and all everything can be given here that is one thing which can be done here next for example if there is a playbacks and all everything so as far as the banking application itself is concerned we don't require and we don't have any kind of playbacks to be made so that hence i am not mentioning any play playbacks or something of that sort at the same time if there is any kind of symbols to be made or something that can be written here at the same time even for example if you want to mention any kind of text messages or something like that can that can be given here 
at the same time i'm going to add you here there is an option called search box where i was mentioning the search box here okay search box either you can put it on top i am just giving you on top here okay search box okay. so search is what the option i am giving because if you want to add any kind of search to the application wherein to connect with or wherein you want to move into the next level and all so this search button is being used for that purpose that's what generally the search button and all everything are used here right so these search buttons and all everything are being used here at the same time if there is any kind of number stepper and all everything so this number stepper can be used that is one thing which can be used but as of now we don't require to use some search button all that stuff or in srls for example if there is any kind of text to be written for example text welcome to xyz right for example right for example if there is any kind of text message to be given right so on the page whatever the page we have so if you want to write down write down any information relating to uh, here right so welcome text page we are happy to serve you all the time as we are i'm just writing some information because in this page what are the related information on the whole page is there so that information i am writing i'm writing some information not exactly the same okay we are happy to serve you all the time as we are one of the leading banking and financial services company provide services to individuals corporates institutions and industries industries right so this is what the information i have written here right so if you want uh, we can cut sort that information according to the requirement what we have all that whatever the related information whatever the required information and all that required information can be extended right services company right services company i can give only right right so this is what generally we have i have written here right this is what i have uh, written here at the same time uh, some 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 text was mentioned here some text was mentioned at the same time uh, you can mention here is reach out as before page 7 about the services we offer That's what we have given. So this is what generally the information we have given here. At the same time, if there is any kind of link to be updated, right? So any kind of link bars or something like these link bars can be updated here, right? So either home products, 
either here link bar can be updated here at the same time you can serve you can add these services also depends on the kind of requirement what we have in all whatever the related and for river whatever the related information and all of the things so that also can be used here so it is that is completely depends on the requirements what we have all that stuff next is there is for example any kind of data data grid right for example if there is any kind of data grid something like this i'll be showing it yeah for example if there is any kind of data grid to be uh, named right so any data grid related information so so this is all basically for a business analyst because to show right the how the page looks like right color combinations right so that even uh, even development team or at the same time user interface designers and all even user interface kit designers can also be prepared so according to the requirements what they have and all of the thing so those details can be kept and as less prepared here accordingly the kind of information what is that we require so these informations can be prepared here when and wherever it is needed so this is how generally this page whatever the page you can see whatever the banking application or a sample page whatever we have created so that can be created at the same time if you want to create any icon names or something like the icon names and all everything can also be used here right so icon names and all everything can be used here or else if you want to use any kind of symbols as i mentioned you these are the symbols we use so this is how generally the page which generally when, when we talk about this balsamic page and all everything we can use so this is for a banking application whatever i was mentioning you and whatever i have shown you it's all about the banking application whatever we have created next uh, i am just adding few more okay because this is what the page we have created which i am aligning here as well yeah here i am aligning all that information whatever is related and all i am mentioning uh at the same time progress bars and all everything not required so these are all the buttons these are all the buttons are there let me explain you these buttons this is for the accommodation purpose which is being used here these are the alert boxes alert boxes are not required so it depends on the kind of application what is that we are creating the type of application the kind of application what is that we use these services and all everything will vary it will not remain same and constant all the time so these services may vary from time to time it will not be the same sometimes the services may get extended to a next level so whatever is related that can be used at the same time for example if you want to put any kind of logos or if you want to create any kind of block texts right so all these things can be used so in reference to the all part i am talking about if this is an this is these are the options especially used for android related because there are some mobile applications we create even sometimes mobile applications we are creating what are the mobile related applications and all everything will be created so whenever we are creating the mobile applications and how these mobile applications looks like right at the same time data pickers circle buttons and all everything even for android applications this can be created with along with that so there is there is an option called assets where if you want to add any kind of assets to be existing stuff can be next this is all something relating to the graphs all that stuff because if you want to present something there if you want to create any kind of bar charts columns chart lines right so if you want to create any kind of pie charts all that so these options we can use what are the options do we have in reality these options can be used here along with this here are the buttons some of the buttons which are available as in today these are the common buttons please do remember when you are working on balsamic whatever the buttons i am showing you these buttons are available from time to time whatever the application we are developing the kind of application it has yeah so whatever the application we have all that stuff so these buttons and all everything will be as it is right so because depends on the type of application these buttons and all everything will be used so this is a continuous process which normally we follow in order to make this application more uh, uh, conveniently better for all the time next next is that common so these are the common buttons but these buttons and commons we use as mainly because every application what are the application we are using what are the pages wireframes and mockups and all everything we are creating so these pages and all everything are common so this is not something different uh, from one to another it will not it will be remain same and it will remain constant all the time 
next along with that containers if there is any kind of container related applications we are creating so these container related applications also can be created here along with it that is one more thing which can be done or else if you want to create any kind of forms or if you want to create any kind of layouts or at the same time if you want to create any kind of text or symbols right so all these things we can use so it's completely depend on the kind of information what is that we require the amount of uh, work what is that we are doing all that so all these things will be used this is how this can be extended yeah this is how it can be extended Whatever the related information and all so this can be extended and this can be created here so this is how generally this banking application is what we create right so whatever you can see here and whatever the application I have created so this is what generally this application will be created at the same time if you want to copy this or if you want to delete any kind of field sets <coughs> that we can do <coughs> but that is not something uh, excuse me but that is not something required because when we are creating banking applications all these kind of applications that sort of information is not essentially needed wherein it was not something really important for us to do or else if you want to create any kind of new wireframes and all we have an option whatever the required and related mainframe uh, related wireframes and all everything so those wireframes can be created once for all whatever it depends on the kind of positions even for example if you want to edit any kind of field sets in reference to the positions or sizes or if you want to add any kind of layers to the existing application or else it could be some color combinations right so for example a color combination if you want to change right so if you want to change any kind of color combinations to the existing way so these color combinations can also be changed depends on the kind of color we want at the same time this even so we can see this uh, shaded and all that right whatever the related shaded relevant shaded and all everything so this shaded yeah so this is how generally the shades all these things can be at the same time this is uh, for a welcome notes of course that is not something uh, really important to understand so this is how generally a banking application whatever i have shown you the application what is that i have created so far and whatever the application I have created in reference to the banking application is what I have shown you here. This is how generally a project, especially for the role of business analyst majorly, at the same time user interface designers, because normally in application development, this will be used by two people. One is business analyst, second is UI designers, UI and UX designers. So business analyst for what reason, for example, if you are developing a banking application where there are some reference documents which was got by the customer, where you want to export the reference documents and all everything to the team, how the page looks like, all that stuff. So for that, what is it required? So it is essentially required, it is essentially important for us to maintain, right? So whatever that we are going to maintain and when are we going to maintain, that information we have to update here according to the requirement what we have whatever the updations and all everything we have to update that's what generally we do here right so this is for this purpose generally because if you want to visualize some information like wireframes and mockups this is how usually we do and the second role was ua and ux designers like user interface and user experience designers user interface and user experience designers are the people who will be used this majorly for different different reasons because Apart from development team in real environment, in application development, there will be some user interface and user experience designers will also be available. So these available, these people's major responsibility and as well as these people's major role is to advise user experiences, to create some user experiences, especially when you are working on travel applications or when you are working on uh, uh, 
uh, what we call uh, not only travel applications when you are working on e-commerce applications and all they require some grandeur because especially there are two kinds one is commercial application second is inside applications business applications so business applications for activity purpose and all they don't require much grandeur because options are more important for them and whatever the options and where are the options putting all that so this is important to them but whereas when you go with the uh, when you are comparing this with the, uh, with other people for example if this you are comparing this with uh, what we call uh, this you are comparing with the commercial application something like uh, e-commerce related applications their expectations are different because the kind of e-commerce uh, the e-commerce domain they are looking for the kind of grandeur they require all these will be varied this will not be the remain the same and constant all the time so this will be varied from uh, person to person this will be very depends on the kind of application it was the kind of type of application it was so whatever the graduates and all everything were essentially required and those were essentially important so it depends on the application to application the time the type of application it was so whatever the changes are we making and all everything we can do here according accordingly so this is how generally two different roles one is business analyst will be used to prepare wireframes and mockups at the same time even this will be used even by the people who are user interface and user experience designers sometimes developers will do this job developers whoever the developers we have so those developers and all everybody will do this job apart from the developers the other people is even uh, user interface designers those people will posted as separate usually in some organizations uh, user interface designers will be as separate those interface design user interface designers will make you to understand the kind of application what we are preparing how are we preparing in what way it is essentially needed so they'll be preparing that apart from the remaining ones all that stuff this is how generally a bulk make is being used especially for uh, business enlisting as well as user interface designers all these people right so this is how it is now this is one example right whatever the example i am showing you this is one example this is what generally the banking example it was and this banking example is this is how generally this banking example is being looks like right so this is one thing next if you want to create any kind of wireframes and mockups and all we can create right so these are the wireframes uh, whatever we have created and all everything this we are created here or else if there is any kind of new wireframes to create even new wireframes can also be created that depends on uh, the requirement or requirement it will get varied it will not remain same and constant because this is a application i have created this is a welcome application i have created next at the same time if you want to create any kind of website kind of stuff right so website samples or if you want to create any kind of mobile related applications or else if you want to create any kind of uh, uh customization so it's something like something customization kind of stuffs or if you want to do any kind of sharing related applications and all so there are different different templates are available especially in balsmic the advantage is that we can create wireframes and mockups according to the requirement what we have according to the requirement what we have here so even whatever the application i have created a banking application apart from banking application now if you can see here this is the application which i am showing you yeah so this is an application which i am showing you this application is entirely in uh, website sample application right so website sample application this will be you can, you can here you can give the website name right so at the same time we can give whatever uh, the informations which are relevant and important right so all these informations can be given right so these website samples and all everything can be created along with that for example if you want to create any kind of mobile sample applications any mobile sample applications whatever is really related and required so for example this mobile application we are developing how the mobile page looks like right how the screen should looks like how the combinations looks like right so for example first name right so uh, let's say i am just mentioning it as hi okay i am not i am not doing it right so for example right so in the mobile application i just first name is hi right so name it as hi i just mentioned it in a funny manner right so not not so important right here last name right rose right so i have just given right hi rose right now brand 
what kind of brand is this for example is this samsung right so this is the brand we are using right so what kind of model mm, maybe some xyz right i'm just mentioning it as one two three right so one two three is the brand uh, model i have given at the same time license plate something like like this some number has given was given here next basic uh, type of insurance is regulatory premium and all so that is a different thing altogether so this is how generally this mobile tech new policy right for example uh, mobile page right i'm just mentioning it as mobile page okay here in this mobile page is what i was mentioned here and i have given some uh, click buttons all that so this is how generally the mobile page was created right? first name last name brand model right license plate insurance types all that right so this is how generally the mobile apps was created at the same time there is an option where if you want to create any kind of desktop applications and all even desktop applications can also be created along with that for example if there is any kind of uh, information where we want to create some uh, getting around like back to the projects or if you want to add some new wireframes or if you want to create any kind of UX libraries, right? So user interface libraries, UX UI libraries means user interface libraries. All these informations can be seen. At the same time, we have an option where we can create more resources, whatever the related and relevant uh, and uh, referred resources and all. So these resources you can see. These are the resources and all everything. These resources and all everything can be seen here according to the requirement what we have all that stuff this is how generally these resources and all everything are being used so yeah new wireframe one this is what the welcome one welcome application which was created if you want to create a new wireframe here we can create one more at the same time any website samples and all everything even websites creation can also be made because what are the related websites we are creating how are these how are we creating the websites in what way these websites are more useful and relevant to us and how these websites can be useful for the people to make it more convenient and better all this we can see at the same time if you want to see any kind of mobile or desktop right? so whatever the mobile or desktop related stuff if you want that also can be mentioned here at the same time if you want to add any kind of add ui controls or customizations right so these customizations mobile controls all these we can use so this is how generally the balsamic majorly it's being used so whatever the application i have created a welcome application called banking this is what the whole scenario is all about the next we are going to create one more wireframe which is as separate which is essentially important and what are these wireframes to be prepared how and we are going to create one more application because here we have created only banking application for an example purpose like this couple of applications for a couple of different different reasons it's not only for a particular reason we are preparing these applications we are creating for different different reasons whatever the reasons whatever the projects we have and all everything so different different wireframes can be created at the same time if you want to create any kind of website samples that also can be created here at the same time we will mobile desktop applications and all all these things will be used one and all right so this is the first application which i have created uh, this is how it is 